Hi, I'm Tim Berry, uh, introducing myself. This is also me in my more preferred habitat. Uh, I'm going to be talking with you through this um, video for a few minutes now. And for more information on me, there's timberry.com. But let's get going with the subject at hand. So I'll put myself down here and let's go. And this particular snippet is about using the plan as you go business plan approach along with Palo Alto Software's Business Plan Pro. First I'm going to look at how to download the add-on template that I've built to bring the software together with this new approach. Let's start with going to planasyougo.com planasyougo.com and we'll go there waiting on the web there it is that's now we want resources and there on the resources we'll right click save target as to download and I'm going to download clan as you go dot plan and notice I have to my system is set to go download into downloads the folder which folder you download it into is important so I'm going to click and there it is and I'll just click open folder and there there it is I'm going to leave that for now and open business plan pro so before I go on quick recap I went to plan as you go dot com and specifically clicked on resources and from there I downloaded so you can see that here too. It's planasyougo.com and resources. So it's that button. Now in Internet Explorer, I right clicked and got save target as. That may be slightly different in Firefox or uh, other browsers. But what we're going to do is download that file. So with that, I'll go on. Here we have Business Plan Pro open, and I've got my standard options here. For now, I'm just going to open the last plan I did, which isn't significant to this particular, but there we go, open that plan. So here we are in a new business plan, standard business plan in Business Plan Pro. We've got the tasks over here and the outline over here. And if we want, we click through next task, next task, next task, and it goes through. And by the way, if we do file, we have new business plan. So that's standard. What I'm going to do is go to my tools menu, templates. There's nothing here, but I'm going to import the one I downloaded and I happen to be on that folder but let's remember you have to find the folder into which you downloaded a few minutes ago there's the file plan as you go plan .pdtx. I open it and it's installed now there it is so I close it so as soon as that's installed the first thing you'll see is if I go to my file menu and I go to new I've got the plan as you go plan as a new option for a new kind of plan and then if I quit and exit business plan pro which I'm about to do and come back again we'll see what happens there so uh, here we are opening business plan pro it asks us if we want the update we'll just check later for that and you'll see business plan pro will open up 
and it's going to come to its startup screen that I'll move here to where you can see it and notice here you've got a new option in the startup screen you could do a regular business plan or a plan as you go business plan so I'm going to click this option and see it says create a new so I have my other things but I'm going to click this and then we'll continue from there as it opens up as with any new plan you need to go through the wizard to establish things like um, basic settings I'm going through this I want to start January of 2009 for this example and uh, plan as you go plan three been working on that give it a name please include the SWOT analysis because I recommend it in the book and set your own settings as they work here uh, I suggest a standard plan now here we are with a new plan the first thing I'd like you to do is click off the tasks we have a special outline here so that the tasks doesn't work so what I'd like you to do is use the outline. I have clicked here to click the tasks off. I could click here to get them back on, but no, I want them off. And I'm going to use the outline to go through my plan as you go plan. And you'll notice it really sets up very much like what I'm recommending in the book. You've got your heart of the plan and the flesh and bones of the plan. And here we see heart of the plan. SWOT analysis, there's the identity, market, and strategic focus. And let's just click on this and show you that the mode is here that the instructions are customized for the plan as you go plan. This is from the book. And remember, we're not insisting that you write topics, but you could type here and create a plan and notice those custom instructions and the outline some of which comes from Business Plan Pro some of which I've recommended but always your instructions for what it is also remember you may not be doing a document you might choose to just include just your business strategy the heart of the plan in this one topic here this is up to you always it's your plan and it's up to you and then with specific plans we have instructions and we have some of the things that I've recommended and we have tables and so on notice that you do have tables for your startup costs and some of what I'm calling basic business numbers in uh, the book milestones there's a table for milestones you will get on tables on some of them some setup and I'm going to hide these instructions for example in the sales forecast the first time you go to it you'll get some setup because in there you can click next task table settings it wants you to go through the software needs to know the answers to some basic questions for example I want to forecast by units and in this case this is up to you but I prefer to just go into the spreadsheet and there we are So there we have it. That's the option of using the template that I've made available for the plan as you go business plan within Business Plan Pro. Installed a little bit of how to use it. Please remember this is only one option. It's also quite feasible to just work within the standard outline and select special topics and tables, the ones that apply. So this stays flexible. As always, it's your plan, not mine. But Thank you for your attention. And I appreciate your time. For more information, here's a number of websites, links, my blogs, uh, my email. And of course, you can pause this um, video and take those down. Uh, and I'll see if I can get them to click depending on which medium you're in. So thank you.